Hi, this is Mary from Second Time Tech, and today I got all the parts for the uh, office PCs that uh, I'm going to build for that small company. So I thought I'd just do a little unboxing. And uh, first thing uh, that we're going to talk about is the uh, case. Uh, the case right here, I don't know if you can see it or not. But it's the Rosewell Ranger M is is the model on it, and like I say, it's just a very inexpensive case. It's like I said, thirty nine ninety nine plus shipping, and uh, so I just brought one of the boxes here. I've got lots more, but uh, don't need to uh, have all of them here. So we'll just uh, we'll just use this one, and uh, basically I'm going to put it on the floor and. Pull out, then I'll put it up on top of the desk so that you can have a look at it. So just one second. There. I took it out of the box and put it up on the table here, and we'll just take the plastic off. And in the case, you get a little book along with it. And uh, it's got a nice little case. I've used cases like this before. Some of them from Rosewell you get, and they are um, like the sides are black, and even the inside is black. Like it's all monochrome. But uh, on this one, almost lost that. But on this one, it's got the old gray color on the uh, inside. I guess this must be to save a little bit of money. And then you got white, white, white wires too, whereas the other ones you get are, have the black wires on it. Uh, the thing that's nice that comes with this is it's got two fans. It has a fan here, which is an uh, intake fan, and then right here it has an exhaust fan. That's an 80 millimeter fan. That's a 120 millimeter fan. And it does have, right here, it has um, like uh, a mesh for air to come in, and uh, so basically, that's what uh, the new uh, case is going to look like for them. And the other thing is, this fan has a blue LED in it, so it shines blue on the front. So that's basically what it is. It's just for uh, an ITX or a uh, was it a micro ATX uh, board? That's all it will fit in it. ATX won't fit. So now let's see what's in the next thing. There we go. And in this, we got the memory. And that's the memory that we got. It's the uh, Patreon signature DDR4, eight gigs of RAM, so just two uh, four gig sticks. And it's uh, 2666 megahertz. And there they are right there. And so we've got four of them. So they'll have some memory in there. Now the next thing is this big box. And it said, Careful, it is heavy. Gosh, I'm heavy. I'll try to lessen the noise. And inside here, we have. Well, first thing we've got here is power supplies. And we've got the four uh, Corsair VS450 um, 80 plus weight uh, power supplies. And on there it says right there, three year warranty. So that's not too bad. And that should work perfectly inside of this because like I said, there's not much need for to have like a whole bunch of uh, uh, 
there's no need for to have a lot of power because 450 watts is plenty for this. So there's the four there. Now the next thing is the SSDs. And the SSDs were Hewitt Packard uh, two, 240 gig. So this is the SSD S600 and it's a 240 gigabyte. And from what I read on it, they were supposed to be TLC, but uh, I'm going to double check all that and see what uh, it actually is. And try not to get QLC. But before I open them, I'll look up what the uh, uh, the S600 model is. It wasn't very much in the description. So we'll have to look and see what we got here. It doesn't really say anything on the outside of it. Three year warranty. Made in China. That's pretty much it. So anyway, so we got our four uh, new Packard SSDs. And they are right there. And the next thing that we got is the motherboards. And what we got here is the, it's a A320 and, uh, well, it says right there to the A320. They're the Pro M2 version two. And these are supposed to be ready for, the uh, 2000 series and I can't remember if these ones were upgraded to the 3000 series or not or if I have to do a BIOS update but it doesn't matter I've got uh, I've got a first gen um, I think it's a 1700 and I can use that if I need to do uh, a BIOS update on it so Four of these, one, two, three, and four. I don't think I've made this many computers since I worked for uh, another company. Now, this is the only thing, is because that's why I said for the 3000 series. But these might still be in there because these are are actually Gen 2 parts inside of it. Because it's just uh, Zen Plus. It's not Zen 2 like the rest of the 3000 series. The, um, the uh, APUs are like one... Um, series back i guess you want to say on the cpus so the architecture in this one is the basically it's the same architecture as what would be in the uh, 2600 except only it's only got um four cores and four threads they keep saying it's four cores and eight threads but the 2200 g is only four cores and four threads. And this is the 3200G, so it should be four cores and four threads. But in the thing, they said it was four cores and eight threads. See, it's wrong, because right there, it does say right on it, it has four cores, four thread processor. But it does go a little bit faster than the 2200G. The base clock is 3.6 gigahertz, and I think the other one, it was 3.4, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong, but I think that's what it was. And it has Vega 8 graphics built into it. Right there. So, basically, that's all the stuff that I need to build most of it. The uh, thing that you need is 
seven parts. So, and then plus windows. So basically, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Because this has the GPU in it. If it's just a CPU, you can only count it as one part. There's no graphics card. Graphics is built into this one. So therefore, you can count it as two. So that's seven items. And then Windows would be the eighth item that you need. And then, of course, after that, uh, keyboard and mouse and uh, a few other things. Uh, probably like a monitor or TV wouldn't be bad either. But uh, joking aside, uh, they have that already. So, because I asked them, they just want the box with Windows 10 on it. So that's all I'm going to make for them. So that's pretty much all I have for uh, this video. It was just a little unboxing to show you the parts that, that came in. I will double check on the uh, on this one, the SSD, because that's the one I'm not 100% sure of, the S600, and see if it's TLC or if it's uh, QLC um, type of uh, flash memory inside there. And uh, then uh, we'll go from there. So. If you liked the video, thumbs up. If you didn't like the video, thumbs down. I want to wish everybody a wonderful day. Thank you very much for watching and listening. Subscribe if you like. Bye.